It's now time for the changing weather. I'm meteorologist Gary Lezak with Weather 2020. A major winter storm is taking aim on Kansas City. Precipitation types is what we're going to go over in this segment and look at the latest data as this winter storm takes shape in the next few days. Still a couple of days away and a lot of things can still change. So let's take a look. Are you excited? Are the kids excited? Let's take a look and see what's going on tonight, today. All right, let's go first of all. I want to show you the snowfall prediction. I drew this map out and have the heaviest snow from around northern Kansas, north of I-70, north of Manhattan, extending across to areas near Kansas City, to Moberly, Missouri, and then to just north of St. Louis, could include St. Louis. So this is where the heaviest snow is expected. In fact, let me take this full screen so you can see that and then I'll zoom in on it and you can see that the axis where the heaviest snow is going to be. How much could fall? Someone's going to get over a foot of snow. Maybe a few of you will. So we'll have to watch and see where this tracks. It could still shift north or shift south. See what I wrote here? Freezing rain and sleet limit snow totals. Right? Freezing rain and sleet limit snow totals. What is freezing rain and sleet. Sleet is frozen rain. So here are the types. Rain, just liquid water reaching the ground and get wet. Liquid water reaching the ground and it's below freezing and it freezes on contact on trees, power lines, and it could be on sidewalks and streets as well if it's cold enough. That's freezing rain that causes the slick conditions and bad conditions. Sleet is frozen rain. That's where the snowflakes melt into this warm layer. The red area is a warm layer. And then they refreeze into little ice pellets. And it is called sleet or frozen rain. Different between freezing rain and frozen rain. All right. And then snow is when it's cold enough through the whole layer and it accumulates. It's fluffy and it's pretty. I love it. So that those are the four precipitation types. So again, when it's warm enough all the way through the layer, it's rain. When it's cold near the ground, but warmer above us, it could be snow melting into rain and then freezes on contact, and then the sleet and the snow, as you can see there. Very interesting scenario. So rain is going to fall way south of Kansas City. There may be a little bit of rain in Kansas City. Then there may be some freezing rain. and. There could be some sleet. As you can see here, sleet is frozen rain. Snow melts in a warm layer above the surface, then refreezes in ice pellets, and it can turn white on the ground with frozen rain or sleet. And then you have this, which is snow. So very interesting. All right, let's take a look at the weather pattern, and you can see what's causing this. There's a storm system now coming in off the west coast, strengthening already, a little stronger than it was forecasted to be. And it's going to come inland tonight and tomorrow, and tomorrow night. So as soon as it comes inland, we'll get a better feel for what it's going to do. So we go take a look at the latest data. This is the latest data from the American model, all right? This is valid tonight, Thursday night. Okay, let's put this into motion, and I'll show you here. Watch. Here we go. Let me go to a closer region into the south central United States. There's Kansas. Here's Missouri. So watch now. Watch this. Here it goes. All right. There's the beginning of some freezing rain. So green is rain, freezing rain, and sleet. And then you have snow and blue. And notice how it gets darker. So a heavy sleet, heavy freezing rain, and rain in the green. And then you can see the heavy snow develops and it moves right into Kansas City on Sunday evening. So there's one key factor here. If it takes that long uh, to come in, then uh, it, don't be surprised if it takes till Sunday to completely change over to snow. It might take till the end of the day, but this storm system is very interesting. In fact, 
If we take a look at the upper levels of the atmosphere, I want you to see where this one feature tracks. See this circle? Look where it goes. Okay, I'm going to put this back about a frame. It tracks from near Wichita, Kansas to right near Chanute, near Joplin, Missouri. If it tracks this far south, Kansas City is going to be in prime position. That heavy snow bed will come right over us. If it tracks farther north, just know things like that happen, it'll suddenly be push that snow amounts farther north as well. So very interesting to say the least. So there's the latest. Uh, right now, I'm expecting it to begin Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, as maybe a little bit of snow, some sleet, some freezing rain, colder air will settle in, and then we'll end up with all types of precipitation that will be coming in, and we'll have more and no more in the next few days. I'm meteorologist Gary Lezak, and I, if you have any questions, please let me know, and make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you for watching The Changing Weather.